breaking news in the trial involving the murder of a Hollywood studio executive. The jury just found John Creech guilty of manslaughter for killing Fox executive Gavin Smith, who was having an affair with his wife. In downtown LA, the verdict was just announced. Randy Page is there, and Randy, the jury found him not guilty of murder, but instead guilty of manslaughter. What's the reaction down there right now? Well, Juan Sander, as you know, in these kinds of cases, it's always a very emotional moment inside the courtroom when the jury announces this decision. Now, keep in mind, the jury had three options here. The prosecution was hoping to prove first-degree murder, but the jury also could choose to find second-degree or voluntary manslaughter. Here is what happened in courtroom, given those choices. We, the jury, in the above entitled action, find the defendant, John Creech, not guilty of the crime of first degree murder of Gavin Smith. We, the jury, in the above entitled action, find the defendant, John Creech, not guilty of the crime of second degree murder of Gavin Smith. We, the jury, in the above entitled action, find the defendant, John Creech, guilty of the crime of voluntary manslaughter of Gavin Smith. Now, John Creech's defense was that he was acting in self-defense, he claimed. He actually testified in this case, claiming that he walked up to a car with his then ex-wife and Gavin Smith inside, that he, that he ducked inside the car, and at that point, a fight broke out. As a result of that fight, Gavin Smith was killed. But his body was concealed uh, for two and a half years. Uh, Creech concealed the body, was not discovered for two and a half years. Of course, uh, the Smith family went through a terrible time through all of this and was hoping for a first-degree murder conviction. Here's Prosecutor Bobby Grace's reaction. Not happy with that, um, but obviously uh, it does indicate that the jurors felt that um, the defendant had to take legal responsibility uh, for the crime that he committed, something less than what we wanted, murder. Um, but he will have to uh, pay a penalty for killing Gavin Smith. And the next step is sentencing. Uh, Prosecutor Bobby Grace says he could be, be sentenced to up to 11 years in prison.